Hey guys, it's Katie and welcome back to another video. It has been a very hot minute since the last time I stepped in front of this camera, but here I am. I've done it. I've made it. I'm back at it again. And did you notice something different? Do I look better? Do I sound clearer? Do I sound crisp? Maybe. And that's because I got new equipment. I got fun stuff. I got a new editing program. I got a new camera. I have like lighting now. I have a microphone. That's four things. That's a lot of things. And I'm very excited to use them all in this one big video debut. It's gonna be very exciting. I haven't done any editing on the editing app yet, but I'm very excited to. I wanna see all the fun things that I can do. Without further ado, here is the actual content of this video. We are gonna go on a journey together. A review journey of Psychedelic Water. So it's called a Psychedelic Water and it's a brand of energy drink. Um, despite its name of Psychedelic Water, it's not drug water. Dex. There is not drugs in this. It's just kind of given that name Dex. because it gives you uh, supposedly Dex. more energy and the cans are very fun. They're kind of psychedelic cans, if you will. So let's open these bad boys up. I have purchased the variety pack. They have two flavors, so it's not much of a variety, but I mean, it's a variety nonetheless because it's not a singular flavor. We've got it open, we're opening the flaps. Look at that, we've got six cans in here, perfection. The cardboard is a little weird. I kind of expected what you'd find on like a metal can beverage, such as like a pop can 12 pack, that kind of cardboard, you know? It's not that kind of cardboard. It is akin to the kind of cardboard you'd find on like a Crayola crayon box. Interesting choice, I'm not here to judge. Well, <laughs> kind of am, it's a review. So we've got the two flavors. We've got this one here. Look how pretty the can is. Oh, okay, wait, focus, maybe. Look at that. Oh, I love technology. Oh, yeah, this is great. This is really great. Look how pretty the can is. It's very cool. Psychedelic water, baby. Uh, this is blackberry and yuzu. And this, uh, the second one, it's a little pink label, is hibiscus and lime. Very exciting stuff. So again, just for the fun of it, here is the pink one up close. Oh, look at that. I know the light's in the way, but look how clear that image is. Wow. I, you know, this is not a paid advertisement, but it damn well should be. Look at that. Oh, it's so cool. It's beautiful. I love it. Oh, so great. Um, wow. I'm, I'm enamored, I have to say. It's, I'm very easily entertained, if you haven't noticed. So the cool thing about these bad boys is that it's an energy drink that supposedly gives you energy from all natural, earthly supplement kind of deals, which we can find on our supplement facts uh, little sidebar here. It is supposed to have kava kava root, damiana leaf, and green tea leaf, all extracts. Um, gives a little bit of caffeine in there, all sorts of fun stuff. I'm sorry I keep looking at the can. It's it's very exciting. I understand why they call it psychedelic. This is, the can, the can is great. Great packaging. 10 out of 10 on that portion of the review. I love looking at this can. I will be saving all of these, absolutely. 100%. So let's just get right into it. Let's come what we all came here to see. What does it taste like? Is it good? We'll see. We will be starting with the hibiscus and lime. Oh, you guys can hear it up close with a new microphone. Are you ready? Are you ready? Was that good for you? That was good for me. First sip, we're doing it. Okay, I'm ready. Oh! Oh, you know, you know what? That is just delightful. That is absolutely delightful. I was not expecting that and it is so good. Oh, I love that. I love that. Hibiscus and lime. 
10 out of 10 for taste. This is great. Let's take another one. Let's rate the mouthfeel. Yeah. This is an A-plus drink. Fantastic. Absolutely, 100%. Oh, that is just great. It is just, it's lightly carbonated, so it's just enough carbonation to give you a zing, but not enough where you're like, ugh. At least that's how I feel when I have like, when there's too much carbonation in a drink, I'm just like, ugh. But this is not an ugh, this is a mmm. This is great. I am, I love this. This, uh, hello, apps, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, it kind of tastes like bubble gum, but in the best way possible. It, I, I promise you, the best way possible it tastes like bubble gum. Oh, yeah. Every sip, I think it's gonna taste worse. It doesn't. It's, oh, it's glorious. Oh, fantastic. Just, oh, my heart is happy when I'm drinking this. So yeah, an absolute 100% A plus on this hibiscus on lime. I have yet to taste a better drink in my entire life. Well, that's not true, but like considering that this is a single drink contained in one can that you don't add anything to, it's fantastic. Here we go. We've got the purple one. It's great. Oh, you guys, do you want the pop can thing again? Do you want it again? Do you want it again? Do you want it again? Do you hear the fizz? Are you hearing the fizz? Oh, just wonderful. Let's give it a quick whiff. Oh, darling, it is lovely. Oh, oh, I'm so excited to try this. Okay, you know, you would not believe how much this is not an, a promotion for this product. I swear, if you don't believe me, look at my follower account. Nobody is gonna be paying me to tell anything about their product anytime soon. Here we go, here we go, we're gonna do it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I will say, I am more of a fan of the hibiscus and lime, but that is not to say that this one is not also absolutely fantastic. Maybe the hibiscus and lime get like a 100% on flavor, but this bad boy is sitting right up there at 98.99. Oh, but, but I am noticing this one has a better aftertaste because the hibiscus and lime one doesn't really have an aftertaste, which some people like. I like too. I think it just kind of depends on your mood, depends on what you're going for. But this has a good aftertaste, and a lot of drinks who don't have that. Either they taste horrible, but they have an okay aftertaste, or they taste great, and they have a horrible aftertaste. But this, they've mastered it. It's great. It's got both. The dichotomy between the initial taste and the aftertaste is absolutely insane on both of these drinks. Should I be double fisting? Let's see. Oh, oh my goodness, both of them together? Wow, all of these flavors are just complementing each other left and right. I know this isn't a terribly interesting review because I'm just so happy with my purchase, but this is incredible. I would highly recommend these um, just for flavor alone. Wow, I will say that I think this is not a flavor profile that would go well with a lot of people. I don't think that it's a drink for the masses. Um, it kind of has a very unique taste that I'm very into. Uh, if I were to describe it to people, you know how there's that gene, supposedly, that some people, when they taste cilantro, they think it tastes like soap? Um, I'm, which I'm one of those people. However, I like it. I kind of like that cilantro tastes like soap. And I think specifically those people, the kind of people that think cilantro tastes like soap and they like it, are the same kind of people that will absolutely love these beverages, 100%. Because I'm noticing there is a tiny little like soap taste in there, but 
I, I, I like it. I'm kind of a masochist, what can I say? The most important part of this review is really how it affects me. If it is a true energy drink, is it going to give me energy? Is it going to give me a mood boost? What kind of effects is it going to have on me? We're going to catch up on all of that in the next part of the video, um, but I think I needed to give it a little bit of time to sit in. So I will check right back in with you guys in about 30 to 40 minutes. We'll see. It'll be really fast for you, not so fast for me, but hey, that's life. That is movie magic if I've ever heard it. So I will see you in 30 to 40 minutes. And hey, welcome back. It's been about 35 minutes since I consumed the very last drop of this drink and I'm here back to report to you. Did you like that transition, by the way? I put a lot of thought into it. So to go a little bit more into um, the kind of herbal supplements that are in these cans, the two big ones that people aren't generally familiar with are Kava and Damiana, and they've both been used for centuries in celebration rituals with the Aztecs and just many other different kinds of cultures have used these for various health benefits. So Damiana, through historical accounts, has been attributed to helping with overall stress reduction and upset stomach, depression, things of that nature, while kava has really one benefit that most people talk about, which is helping to reduce anxiety. And so that's why these two herbal supplements are combined into this one energy drink, along with the green tea, which is uh, caffeine. That's what that helps with. That's what that's there for. So those three items together are supposed to give its consumer uh, feelings of just a general mood boost and maybe less anxiety, less stress, more productive because of the energy that it supposedly gives you that I feel it gave me, but that's just me. I am one person. I can't vouch for everyone, but that's just been my experience. So now that that's out of the way, let's move into my final thoughts on the psychedelic water herbal supplement energy drink. I really liked it. I really liked both of the flavors and I liked both of the flavors together, which was a fun thing to kind of explore and put together. I am feeling quite great, if I may say so myself. I feel more energized. I feel awake. I just feel... I feel calm too, like it's kind of a quiet energy kind of thing going on. I feel like I want to be productive. I feel like I want to be creative. I would say that this can has done its job. Um, very exciting stuff, as I've been mentioning. Everything is very exciting to me. I do feel more awake, I feel energized, I feel ready to roll. A true 10 out of 10 product, as long as all of the ingredients in it are safe to go into your body specifically, I would highly recommend it. Thank you all so much for making it to the end of this video. It really means a lot. And do you know what else would really mean a lot? If you subscribed, go ahead, do it, do it, do it, do it. I hardly post anyway, you won't even know I'm here. It'll be great, it would be a great symbiotic relationship that I think we should have. If you have any other questions or comments for me, leave a comment in the comment section below. It'll be great. I'd love to interact with you. Like this video, share it, do whatever you want. I don't care. We're all friends here. This is a really long outro, so <laughs> I'm gonna end it now. Again, thanks for watching, and I will see you later. Alligators? <laughs>